And Psycho Talk tonight, Fox News blowhard Eric Bowling. Now, this guy is complaining about President Obama using Air Force One to talk to the American people. He delivers a State of the Union, immediately flies off and, and goes and hits five states. Now, he picked five swing states. Air Force One, guys. $181,757 per hour to operate. So I just did a little math. I followed the money a little bit. I did the, the flight times between the cities. Eight hours and 48 minutes, and that comes to about $1.6 million just to fly that airplane around the country. Forget, you know, security and the other yeah. things that are associated with it. But So it's costing the taxpayer a lot for Mr. Obama to show up but in these places. Messy. Fox News must have the stupidest viewers on the face of the earth to think that this is a story or an issue. Eric, I, you know, I don't know what you've been doing. Maybe you've been having too many cool ones across the street. Presidents, listen up, they routinely tour the country on Air Force One after the State of the Union. President Bush certainly did. The day after Bush talked about privatizing Social Security in his 2005 State of the Union address, Eric, he was in my hometown of Fargo, North Dakota, pushing his plan at the Bison Sports Arena. I put out an idea last night that I think is important, to allow younger workers to take some of their own payroll taxes and set, aside, set it aside in what's called a personal retirement account. Key soundbite there. Did he say last night? That means it was the State of the Union, and then the next day he was on the road. President Bush didn't take a commercial flight to get there. They don't have too many of those going into Fargo. I personally saw Air Force One land in Fargo. It was a smooth landing, by the way, Eric. But now, President Obama's doing the same thing, and Eric Bowling, well, in Fox News, they just can't handle it. Eric, now, since you're the expert when it comes to presidential planes and vice presidential travel, maybe you can explain to me why Dick Cheney always seemed to take Air Force Two to South Dakota to go pheasant hunting. Did he pay for the gas on that, Eric? For Bowling to complain about President Obama using Air Force One is high-flying psycho talk. What kind of